Okay, guys, in this tutorial, we're gonna fix the issue. Uh, so, Windows 11, uh, your headphones, it's not detecting. You have connected your headphones, it's a wireless headphones, or let's say one with the jack uh, to your or USB mm, plug to your Windows 11 PC. And your Windows uh, 11 PC is not at all detecting your headphone. So, how do you fix that issue if it is not detecting your headphones? A couple of easy steps that you can follow. So one of these uh, few easy steps will definitely help you. You can follow the tutorial even for the older and upcoming version of the Windows. It might help you. Very, very first step that you can follow is. So this PC or my computer, you're gonna see. Just give a right click on it, and then click on Properties. So when you click on Properties, it will come up with this uh, Properties space. Here you have Advanced System setting. Uh, manually you can go to the source and type advanced system settings you can even access from the source directly on windows so in a taskbar you have a source go and just type advanced system settings as it is and you can click on it and open this page so here you have the advanced system settings uh so properties what are you going to do go to the hardware click on device installation settings so in a device installation settings here you have an option to choose yes do you want to automatically download manufacturer app and custom icons available for the device you're going to choose yes click on save the change and then you're going to restart your pc and then after you're going to check it if your headphone is detecting if it is not detecting come back to the same place what you're going to do is you're going to select no click on save the change and then restart your PC and then you're gonna check if your headphone is detecting. So I guided you as here is the couple of options. So sometime you're gonna yes because it's a recommended one. Sometime yes it will work for you. Sometime some of this uh, your device might not be some of your device might not work as expected. So you're gonna sometime uh, these options work for you. You're gonna choose now. So whichever options work for you, you're going to go with that. So these options work for me, so I'll go with that. So when, uh, you're going to change it, uh, alternate, and then check. Make sure to restart your PC after making a change. And one by one, you're going to come back to the same place again, change the options, and check which one is working for you. If this is still persist, uh, you're going to give a right click on it, and then click on Manage. So you don't have a Manage here, click on Show More Options. And then here is the manage. So this will come up with this uh, windows. Let me make it a little bit smaller. You can see it. You can click on device manages. And here you have sound, video, and game controller. So arrow like icon, click on that. This is the number of options. These are uh, my so headphones. So airport it is a uh, wireless headphones it is detected it's a airport pro hand free it's detected so all this uh, external audio uh, sorry audio sound lots of your audio device that has been uh, detected when that is connected to this pc so a couple of uh, wireless audio device detected is connected to the pc so if your device is not detected if you, or if you see red icons over here as uh, so icon like this uh, that means uh, it is detected and it's not working. So what you're gonna do is just give a right click on it and update the drivers Okay, sometimes source for the updated drivers are on Windows update you're gonna click on this and then Install all the necessary update check it check for the updates download and install all the necessary updates restart your PC This will fix the issue updating the Windows updates all necessary drivers so far now what you're going to do is uh, if that option do not work for you you're going to disable and enable it again you're going to uninstall the driver when you click on uninstall you'll come up with these options if you have some older version of windows uh, other than windows 11 you'll have options over here do you want to uninstall the software so if you check that box your software will be uninstalled from your device and you have to manually install it so uncheck that box we do not want to uninstall the software from this computer 
but we just only want to uninstall the installed driver from here and then click on uninstall and then restart your PC. So when you restart your PC, it will automatically install the driver again. And then one by if that option also do not work for you, what you're going to do is uh, you can even scan for the hardware changes. So it will scan for the hardware changes. Sometimes this option also works. So you, you, when you have tried all these options, it do not work for you. Go to the properties. Like say previously your headphone was working fine on this device and it is not working after updating the drivers. So what you're going to do is roll back your driver. Go back to the previous driver. Driver one that is was working. Currently I cannot update it because there are no new driver I have installed. No new newest version of the driver I have installed. It's the same person as it was before. And the newest person of driver if you have installed manually into your PC and previously it was working fine. So you can roll back to the previous driver. So this option is currently grayed out. If you have the newest person of the other person of driver installed uh, later on, you can roll back it. So all these were the possible best as a solution that you can try in order to fix this issue. If the solutions really help you, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, comment and share this video with your friends and family. It might help you.